Yo, I'm juicing up some fresh produce that I just got from the farmer's market today. Tim here. I am a new YouTuber putting up videos about health, wellness, abundance, and love. One way that I get all of those things into my life is through delicious fruits and vegetables. Now, parsley, direct from a Connecticut farm in New Milford. Now, probably pick today. Check this out. This is hydroponic, I know, crazy, wave of the future, sorrel. And this stuff tastes like lemon. I'll rip you off a little leaf so you can see it. Now, just watch my face when I put this in my mouth. And this can't be faked, I'm telling you. Check this out. A little bit of dirt on there too from the farm, but hey, oh my god, it, every cell as you bite it bursts with this lemon flavor. Check this out, they even give you it in the original soil. Basically they say this is going to stay alive for a few days when you put it in your fridge when you get home, unlike a vegetable that's been clipped. It's brilliant. The name of this farm is like Two Guys, Two Guys from Woodbridge, something like that. It's funny because they actually moved to another town near that town, Woodbridge, but they're actually in Hamden now. And so they're called Two Guys from Woodbridge, actually Hamden. And my buddy Kyle, he's my roommate too, and look him up on YouTube, Kyle Newman. He's making videos too now. And he asked me, Oh, where, where, uh, you know where these guys are from? As we're looking through the produce, I'm just like, you see the sign, man? It says two guys from Woodbridge. And it turns out they're not from Woodbridge. Classic irony right there. Okay, let's get this going. I can keep you right here all day. Right now I'm waiting on Naomi to get here. We are going to a concert down the street. Naomi's an old friend of mine from a past job working at a place called Nature's Classroom, which was a residential education center for fifth to eighth graders. So, first thing I will do is I will chop up some apples. The pectin in apples, super purifying. And I find it to be one of the most nourishing plant sugars. I do the cores, you can leave the cores out if you want. If you have extra time to core them. Supposedly there's arsenic in there, but I've never noticed any effects from it personally. So I am cutting up about five to six apples. And they will form the base of my juice. Now, when you're starting out juicing, you wanna put a lot of sweet fruits in it, like apples, Carrots, that's a vegetable. Carrots, sweet things like carrots, beets, vegetables. The more savory fruits and vegetables to start. And then slowly shift that balance to having more of the bitter and the aromatic herbs in there. Because those are the most healing to the body and the most restorative. Now as far as energy and taste, really sweet fruits are going to give it to you there. And that will naturally happen, you know. You'll get used to the taste of the juice. Because it can be a little bit different at first. It's not like it's not like apple juice from the store or orange juice from the store. You know, when you're drinking a juice with several different ingredients in it, and there's still some of that pulp in it, you know, it, it's almost, you know, the earthiness and the, the realness factor just kind of psh, hits you right in the face to start out when you're juicing. And then you realize that that's how food's supposed to taste. And you're going to be looking for that in everything you eat and drink from here on out. So juice, 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 juice again, and then juice some more. Because it literally is one of the best stepping stones to overall health out there. Period. Better than any book. Just get a juicer. What I use is the Omega. 
It is a auger juicer, so it slow grinds and processes the stuff you put in it at a really slow speed, keeping the enzymes intact, as opposed to a centrifugal juicer, like, uh, you know, every company makes their own version of a centrifugal, but just YouTube it. That's how I first decided on what juicer to get was I freaking YouTubed it. And then from there, I found the Lifer Generator from look that dude up if you don't know who he is and I found all the, the raw foodists and eventually found my way to yoga, found my way to spirituality, meditation, good food, good living and that's my trajectory to health right there. Alright, a little bit behind here is the assembly juicer. Okay. So we got apples, we get those going, and I got my parsley, my apples, another thing I'm going to put in this juice is my organic celery hearts. You know, I, I don't know if the celery is grown in this area, because I don't see it at farmer's markets. Anyway, chop off the butt of the celery and then you end up with these stalks that, with the omega it's cool because you can just stick the whole thing in there without having to cut it off much. Here we go. Can't find my little... starting up a YouTube channel <laughs> and I'm inspiring people to get healthy and I'm making a juice for them. Nice! So, how was your drive? It was super easy. There was no traffic here. It was great. Alright. Some celery. <laughs> Let me just stuff oh, the shit in there. <laughs> And celery is a high, a high water content food. It's like 80, 90 percent water. So basically, when you juice it, it's just, it's just structured water. It's like, it's like nature's filtration system through the celery, and everything else in the juice is going to be able to get absorbed into your bloodstream super quickly in that structured water. Pepper and some parsley, smell that. This is from the farmer's market today. Is it? And I can probably stuff this in there in two bunches. Come on! You know, juicing itself is like a workout. <laughs> Speaking of workouts, I was I was outside today, and I was I was doing my calisthenics routine in my yard. I was doing push-ups. I'm talking to everybody who's listening, honestly. <laughs> and and like the little the little kids downstairs. Oh, there's Mandy. Hi. So I have a lot of distractions, but I'm gonna get through this video with you. I'm Mandy. Hi. Mandy. Hi. You haven't met Nene ever? Where would we have met? Um, Where are you from? It's in there. So I, I purposely planned this because I have a lot of friends and I love this. Awesome. Oh. I'm making a YouTube hi. video. Say hi. Oh my god. Really? <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm getting I'm getting myself out there, Mandy. Get yourself out, out there, sir. Wow, that looks so good. Now, if anyone's still watching the video at this point, 
Good for them. It's like 10 minutes long now. Wow. But I'm showing them how to make celery, parsley, apple. Oh, I forgot ginger we're going to add too. Juice. That will literally rejuvenate your entire life. In every, every sip. Wonderful. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I got a whole part of celery in there. I got a head of parsley. And next we have our apples. And again, fructose, 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 and more fructose. You can have as much plant sugar as you want. Now, I'm not a doctor, but that's what I believe. And. Yeah, this, this omega juicer doesn't take that well to, to the really mashy fruits like apples, but it's better for things like wheatgrass and, and herbs and, and the, more, the more leafy vegetables. But we're going to give it a try anyway because we want some sweetness in our juice. Oh, aren't you sweet? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Um, what were your questions? Oh, I was just going to say, can you say you're saying for the night? Because I think, well, I want to do it. Are things happening tonight? Well, yeah, I was thinking, because I have tomorrow off, so I was thinking yeah. of maybe doing like a fire or something. Yes. Yeah? yeah. Um, that'd be cool if you guys are YouTubers, okay YouTubers, come down to Norwalk tonight. We have a fire going, apparently, after the show. Damn, I want to see the leafy stuff. It's going to be crazy. Yeah, I'm excited. Well, yeah. Fun. Yeah. Well, Oh, I forgot to show you too. I got the most beautiful lettuce today from the farmer's market. Look at that. I mean, come on, it just like unfolds in your hands. Oh, I actually ate an entire head of this on the way home. <laughs> yeah. I wanted just like popcorn. Anyway, I'm gonna let you go. I'm okay right now. You too. My juicer's not working that well with the apples, but I'll show you what I got so far. Sorry, I the I'm going to add lemon and ginger to this. But as you can see, that's what happens when you put vegetables through a juicer. You get this structured, enzyme-rich tonic that you can drink every day, and it'll help restore your body, heal whatever is going on. I personally have healed myself from several undiagnosable strange bodily things going on so I encourage you to juice do yoga stay active move your body and just live your life so I'll catch you later peace